in my mind. Good morning, Manja. Good morning, sir. You well? Yes, I'm good. Uh, is Dibu? No, she's not yet arrived. At this time? Mm. It's late. Please, let her know that I want to see her in the office. Okay. <laughs> Good morning to you too. Oh, sorry, Wanja. Good morning. Yeah, he just got in. He actually wanted to see you. Really? Mm. And what did you tell him? The truth that you had not yet arrived. You mean you can't cover for someone? D. How many times will I cover for you? Don't you have an alarm? Why are you ever late? Imagine at times it's not my fault. You should see the traffic in my road. G. I live three blocks away from you. Why am I never late? It beats me. Anyway, let me go see what he wants from me. Okay. I took a risk getting you a job in this company. Remember what we said? Start small, then grow into a better position. But if you keep playing with your job, you will not get a position. I will remember one day. Let me go see him first. See you. Bye. Barabara na akanipea lift. Na yeye mambo ya kucheka ni sababu aliniambia kitu fani. 
Ji, unajua kuna msichana mpya ukucha hapa kabla ya posa cha mti. Wewe sio kwanza. Mimi sio kwanza. Hata kuna uzuri ni tongozi. Unajua mtu si wetu anapenda wasichana warembo, 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 warembo. Na sijui mbona nyinyi wasichana warembo. Muone mtu si mkora. Pata msio graduate si utauta kwa mchao mimi hapa. Acha niende. Asubuhi did you just suspect anything? No, actually pretend that like I was in a hand which fell for it. He actually came in asking for you. Sweet, <laughs> but he said, "Wait, we need to be extra careful. Okay, let's keep this a secret. You know, she wanted us to date, but I refused. So I don't want her to tell you lies about me and spoil what we have." Okay. Why would she do that? I know her from church and she's a good girl and she has been nice to me. You too, my dear. Churches are pretenders. I'm well, sure, but I don't think she's one of them. Okay, if you say so. But anyway, remember what I told you, okay? If you agree to my terms, mm -hmm. I'll take care of you, your siblings, and also I'll promote you, okay? Yeah. You do nice to be a tea girl. Hmm? But first I'm scared. I don't want to put my principles aside. Yes, it's a good deal. But you're a married man. Yes, a married man. But in love with you. Crazy. <laughs> Can I have the time to think about it? Oh, as you think about it. Let me give you something else. Eh? Spoil yourself, okay? All this for me? Yeah. This could suit my sister's band. Thank you. I appreciate you. Sir, the 12 o'clock appointment is in the office. Right away. Okay. No, Miss Kiliza, I'm not kidding. Take care of your siblings and be a great example to them. Mom, I will do everything to make sure they finish school like I did. I promise. Not bad, my mom. Wonder who is your team? Thank you. D, can we talk? Right now? Yeah. Aren't you busy with that? No, I can spare a minute. Okay. Close the door. Okay. Do you mind explaining what I just saw? I... That was nothing. Imagine I had asked you for my brother's balance. I mean, my sister's balance. And he gave it to me. I was so excited. Super excited. I just found myself bouncing on him. I forgot myself. You know me. D, you're too excited that you throw yourself at a boss you have barely known for three months. But you know me, Wanda. You of all people know how I am. I just get excited. And then, you know how tough it has been for me for the past three months. Mm -hmm. And God is finally answering my prayers. Can't I be happy? I was just excited. I understand. Mm -hmm. But you need to be careful. He's a very great boss. But he has very poor moral ethics. Please stay away from him. So you, Wanda, you sound so bitter. Do you like him? Like who? Mr. Komu. <laughs> Where are you getting all these ideas from? Well, I was just saying, but you know, he is cute. Yes, he's cute and married. Eh? Listen, I have seen a lot of girls come in here and leave broken because of him. Eh? So be very careful if you don't want to be like one of them. Sawa sawa. Sawa. Okay. I'll go to the kitchen. Sawa sawa. Okay. Have, enjoy your tea. Thank you. There is nothing you cannot do but to cope with There is nothing you cannot do to have a overdo. I have to stand up here. Oh my goodness. See my God. One, two, three. I'm really tired of counting. Hey, thanks to God for me. Anyway, it's time for me to write a testimony to church. This time, we shall read my testimony. It's been so long. Let me write. <laughs> Praise 
God. I write this testimony to testify of the goodness of the Lord in my life. After praying for a job for so long, God used a member of this church to help me get one. That's not all. I have gained favor in that company that I'm looking at a promotion very soon and to add icing to the cake. God used the boss to give me miracle money that I will use to clear my sister's school fee and have some cash remaining to do some house shopping. God has really been faithful to me. I give him the praise. Good morning, good people. Good morning, sir. You're well? Yes, sir. Okay, let's go straight to the meeting. Okay, you can continue. Just a minute, we're going to read the minutes from the previous meeting. Okay, let me find where the minutes are. Right here. So, in the previous meeting held, we had four members present and one member who sent in an apology. We discussed about the books that are in waiting for publishing. Mm. We have so many books in waiting for publishing. Mm. But then, we have books that have already been released, mm. and we have to market them. Yes. So we decided we look for strategies to market these books. Mm. And then last but not least, mm. we discussed that each and every member of the board will be contributing 10,000 shillings mm -hmm. per month mm -hmm. to support the needy students, mm -hmm. which will be used for their school fees and whatever they may need in school. Yeah. Without any other business to be discussed, we ended the meeting with a word of prayer from Mr. Ndum, who is absent today. He sent an apology. Okay, okay. thank you so much. So today I want us to finalize on the pending matters on our previous uh, agenda. Yes in order to ensure that things run smoothly. Thank you, sir. Mm. We have, currently we have two trucks mm. that will transport the equipment and mm. the podium to the ground. That's nice. It's wonderful, right? Mm. Yes, sir. The media, we are ready. Mm. Uh, we have uh, bought new sets for media, mm. and also we've trained new members on how to handle the new equipment that are coming in. Uh -huh. We have not yet discussed on the books that we are yet to publicize. Mm and the strategies to market the ones that we have. Hey guys, please. We, we must be serious, okay? Mm -hmm. This time round, mm -hmm. we must go with speed. Mm -hmm. Let's find ideas. Mm -hmm. And uh, because other books are coming, mm -hmm. so we can't release when the rest are still here. Mm -hmm. So let's uh, challenge ourselves, mm -hmm. and I know you guys will do it very nicely. Yes, sir. And then we push. Yes, sir. So that would be okay? Yes, sir. All right. So next meeting, please, I'm expecting to hear a good report. Yes, we are good? Yes, sir. Okay. I don't hear you. I don't hear you. I don't hear you. You loose girl. How would I know if it's mine? Who else have I been intimate with? How not I, you. How would I know? Hey, you went out there, got yourself pregnant, then you were up because you want my money. Let me tell you, for your own information, this company is for my wife and my family, and you won't get any penny. Hey, saying that yeah, I have your child, Niko na Mimbayako. Wait, you think I want your money? I don't want your money, but this child, you're going to take responsibility. Hmm. Hmm. Waja? Yes, sir. Confirm with the HR how much we owe this con of a woman and give her that money. I'll disappear, Kabisa. Yes, sir. Wapula! Yes, sir. Come, come, come. Kuja, Baraka. Please, remove this lady out here. Sim, sim, taki yata, na siwa ikuja kwa ikompon. Ata kwa ikuja, dear boss, dear boss. Yes, sir. Yes, yes, get her out of here. Stop him, stop him. 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 What have you done? You should have listened to me. He told me that you will tell me lies about him because he refused your advancement. Pana, wanja jai taka pos pos diyo ni kwa namto ngosa wanja na kamkata tomana diwa leo na tujua vipavle na tujua kwa nchi notice. Aki wanja what have I done? 
<laughs> do you even send your testimony to church, telling them that God has opened doors for me, not knowing that I had to open my legs for the miracle to stay open? promotion, promotion, promotion. Mombasa trip to business trip. You need to start telling the truth. Huh? Start with God, yourself, and the pastor. But most importantly, your bum. She needs to know where you've been getting the money to take care of her for the last ah, one year. Pana wanja. Ah, wanja chana yeye. Yeye funzo kwa kena kwa chana wengine ambao wanapenda kuchiwa ili wapate pesa. Ah, wafula. Eh. Wanja, listen. Hmm? If you receive warnings from more than one person, that should raise red flags. Oh, I needed to learn from experience. No, no, you didn't need to learn from experience. You see, when I was new, Wafula also told me about our boss. Yeah. And I listened. And that's why me, si jabata situation kama yako, you should have just listened and avoided all these things. If you work hard, you will still get promoted without necessarily opening your legs. Yeah. Anyway, here is your here is the cash. <sighs> Anda na Yesu. Sorry. Maisha iko hivyo kupanda na kushuka. Sasa umeshuka kama mimi huko chini. Sikia vile maisha yako. Hai. But you can still move on with me if you want. I'm only a living. Sasa kuchukua. Unaweza kuja kwangu. Ndakulinda na mtoto wako. Twende. Tendo kwa bibi yangu bwana. Ah, kwenda.